The school of worship within Youth of the Mission began in the late 80s, early 90s with a clear vision, a clear mandate out of Psalm 96.3 to declare His glory among the nations. His glory, all the nations. That's it. That's the agenda. That's the heart of the school. And as Wyrum Tyler, we joined the movement in 2006. That's when we started and pioneered the school here. And it grew and developed ever since. But what are we after? What is this thing about? I always think about the story in Genesis 18 where we read about Abraham sitting in front of his tent in the heat of the day. And he's processing all the things that have happened in his life. You know, he, he left his home with his family. He went to an uncertain future. And we know that every SOW student within YWAM has at least done a DTS. And so we treat our students that way. We treat our students as people who left, who, who started the journey with God into the unknown territory of world missions. And so Abraham is sitting in front of the tent in the heat of the day, processing these prophetic words that are way too big for him. And then we read that Yahweh appeared to him. And without hesitation, Abraham gets up in the heat of the day and he runs towards Yahweh and falls down and worships him. Even though Abraham was desperate and processing all kinds of things, worship was a priority in his life. And so for a worshiper, worship is always a priority and nothing can overtake it. And in the school, our heart is to train men and women to comprehend worship biblically, to stand securely, and to live excellently. It's not a mere music school, but it's a school to train people not just to experience God's presence, but also to confidently communicate it to others, to declare His glory among the nations. It's an intense school. We pack a lot of things into the lecture phase and, and then we take off for outreach. This is why of course we take off for outreach. We want to reach the nations with His glory. It's not a mere music school. It's a school to train people not just to experience God's presence, but also to confidently communicate it to others, to declare His glory among the nations.